With all the scripts actors and special effects it is amazing that movies get made at all. Of course, when the film does make it to the big screen it is usually all worth it. Well until you start noticing all sorts of little mistakes and slips that made it through editing that is what we are here for sit back and relax and let us show you some of the more interesting oversights that survive the editing room. The Empire Strikes Back The Empire Strike Back out of the original trilogy The Empire Strike Back is now considered by most fans and critics to be the best however like the other films this is not without its mistakes. Let us take the iconic clash on Hoth as an example in one scene Luke climbs up underneath an Imperial walker and destroys it using a thermal detonator, the whole thing is cool except for one little slip as the 8080 fall. You can still see the stick used by the prop crew to push the model of the walker rover. Jason Bourne The most recent installment in the Bourne franchise Jason Bourne was not as well liked as in the original trilogy. Maybe the various slips and mistakes had something to do with that. For instance, when Matt Damon is supposed to be in London England you can clearly see Luke's Sour Hotel in the Las Vegas in one of the shot during the final car chase through Las Vegas. The damage to Bourne's Dodge Charger comes and goes while the armored car he is chasing is causing vehicles to shoot straight up in the air. Alien Covenant We guess of laws of physics don't really apply in Nevada Alien Covenant the latest in the ongoing Alien franchise Alien Covenant look to pick up where Prometheus left off. We will skip all the numerous fan complaints and simply head to one thing that bothered us at the end even if we believe that the colonists ships computer accepted David it still leaves one thing that bugs us namely how does David know the exact container size needed for the embryo storage after all when he regurgitates two aliens embryo they are both a perfect fit for the tray that holds human containers. And man. And man, one of the lesser characters of the Marvel Universe fans nonetheless love Paul Rudd as Ant Man. When the movie came out in 2015, the film provided us with a different kind of superhero, which was kind of refreshing in the grand scheme of things. That said, Ant Man did have its fair share of mistakes. One that you might have misses involved Rudd's foray into the pipes you see pipes donut printing welds and flanges on the inside you would not actually see any of those things because they are all on the outside. Well, it was still a very fun. Quantum of Solace Quantum of Solace Let's face it we are willing a lot of over the top stunts and physics defying logic when it comes to James Bond yet. Well, 007 can perform miracle stunts not everyone else can on the Quantum of Solace someone forgot to tell one of the extras about his clearly visible in the background at the Haitian port. We can see one extra sweeping nothing but air. Wonder Woman Who doesn't love Wonder Woman there is something just so awesome about watching Gal Gadot kick the butt of a bunch of enemy soldiers anyways some tiny goof you will actually hear and not see in this film involves sidekick Steve's Trevor played by the Chris Pine when he is getting out of the bath and getting dressed the camera pans Gadot and we hear an audible zip as Pine does of his pants. There is just one problem that zippers were not used in the men's pants until 1920s years after the events of the movie had taken place. Fate of the Furious
Alright so making fun of goofs in the Fast and Furious movies is not much of an accomplishment but we will still give it a go for you military buffs out there. The fate of the Furious and Fast and the Furious 8 likely left you shaking your head even if we ignore the outlandish speed and ice smashing abilities of the Aquila submarine there is that ridiculous heat seeking missile seen given slowest missiles still travel several hundred miles per hour. Ben Diesel's car must have been doing a similarly impossible speed all while maintaining control of ice and snow. Spider-Man, Homecoming Given yet another reboot this Spider-Man seems to be a fan favorite alas like every Marvel film there are many goofs and mistakes but well we'll focus on just one. We are talking about the fairy scene where the ship gets chopped in half length wise and does not sink clearly that fairy must have been built out of foam because any other ship would have filled up with water incredibly fast not that but when the Iron Man welds everything back together the ship does not sit any lower in the water. Rogue One. Thanks to that entire extra weight Rogue One, Rough One gave us gritty and entertaining moves that show the universe beyond traditional franchise storyline one character fans really enjoyed was to root in the way the blind spiritual warrior monk whose wit marched his skills with a staff on jets. We saw Chirp dispatch a group of stormtroopers with these. Yet this is where one slip happens while fight one trooper among kicks up dirt. Into this fact, in addition to reacting too quickly, the stormtrooper acts like he is mortally wounded even though his helmet should have stopped a little dirt. First, he walks now dirt set armor do anything. Thor Ragnarok The newest installment in the Thor storyline has been really well receiving. In fact, Ragnarok is so good that we can only find a handful of small continuity and stunt slip ups. For instance, when Thor throws Loki at a group of guards. If you watch it carefully, one of the enemies goes flying backward without being hit. In other scenes that show our heroes or Hela right before or after a fight the numbers of bodies on the ground constantly changes from shot to shot that said it is still a great movie.